If you want to transfer data from your old phone to Samsung Galaxy A36 5G, what you can do is you can simply use the Smart Switch app that you can find, for example, in the Samsung folder by default in the apps screen. So if you go over here, you should be able to uh, transfer all data and on your old phone, if you have Play Store or the App Store, if it's Apple device, then of course you can search for the app as long as it is not Samsung. Because if you had Samsung, if your old phone was also Samsung, then most likely you already have Smart Switch. But you can search for Smart Switch in the App Store or the Play Store and you should be able to install it on your old phone. So, once we open these two, so I assume that you already have on your new phone and your old phone, then over here we can press continue. We need to grant permissions. And then we want to receive on this phone since this is the new phone. So um, you might need to charge your phone as well because if you have low battery then unfortunately you might not be able to transfer these files. Uh, but essentially now we need to select the source. So if you had Galaxy or Android then of course we want to select this option. If you had an Apple device choose iPhone or iPad. I'm going to select Galaxy Android. And we want to do this wireless, in my case at least. Of course, you can also use cable, but I'm going to do this wirelessly. And now we can press let's go on our old phone. Also choose wireless. And now we need to wait for these two devices to connect together. There we go. We need to accept the connection. There we go. We are connected. The phone, the new phone will scan our old phone. And now we can choose what we want to transfer. So we can transfer everything, just accounts, calls, contacts, and messages, or we can go to custom. And here we can also tap to see what cannot be transferred, which is um, apps or actually data that cannot be transferred due to apps policies. So if you select custom and if you go next, then you have the option to choose what you want to transfer. If you, for example, want to transfer only images, then of course you can select it here. And then we can press transfer. And there we go. We are now transferring files. And there we go. Done. And we can go to home screen or oh, we also have the results we can tap here in order to see everything that we have transferred and that is pretty much it thanks for watching leave a like and subscribe to my channel and see you in my next videos bye